Yo, what's good with it, man? We back with another reaction video. This is uh Chris White pulling up on Nick Riz. Uh, I don't know what happened. I uh, just saw the thumbnail and the recommendation. I'm just gonna get straight into it. I was this close to falling asleep up until this Nick Riz, the fake savage, to my attention. I was asking staff to escort me. What the fuck? The real sports world today, and I don't, I don't think it's really about it. Fighting was, you know what I'm saying? Video, so can it's you pretty obvious, my name. It's just white boys not talking. Single, not double, but triple uploading today. What about that? Who doing it like Matt? No, I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. We ain't here to hear all this. I'd appreciate if you joined the family. Nah, I'm just playing. But on some real stuff, I'm not gonna waste your time. We're just gonna jump straight into it. Alright, let's see. In some of Chris's Instagram and YouTube lives, he was saying how he's gonna find Nick wherever he goes. That's kind of weird. He's gonna pull up on him every place he goes. I that, that's kind of weird, bro. You stalking okay, the man? I'm not gonna say I thought he was trolling, but I didn't think he was gonna do it seriously every time. And today, well, tonight, he pulled up on him. Nick was okay. at a basketball gym. I'm not too sure where at. Chris pulled up, and Matt wrote a clip. Let's see. Oh, this is this is Chris recording. I thought you pulled up with the cameraman. I don't know why I thought that. Internet goofy. Yo, what? Isn't Nick the run running? Damn. Right, that clip I just showed you. That's the first one. There's there's two more. more and two more. Chris put. He put God. hashtag Nick Briz clenching like a you know, female geek. Laugh, laugh, laugh. He don't want to come outside. He a female little geek. Chris is actually a certified menace to society. That oh, God, man, bro. Who would do off, that? How did he find him? In That's the what I'm saying. You got his location on, bro. Pulled up. And if you want you gotta, to see you put the tracker on his car or some shit, bro. That's not what Chris would do. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to lie, bro. I'm not fighting no nigga like Chris, bro. It's like 65260, bro. Holy shit. Savage Squad. Won't come outside. Lucky I didn't catch him telling the manager to tell security. Scared. Okay. Do you want to come outside? If you really did that, that's some bitch shit, bro. Do you want to come outside? Let's go off this premises. The boy got the slides on. Nick wasn't by himself, was he? I don't think he was that dumb. I don't know about that one, bro. I put you in my pocket. You a whole female. Damn. Don't talk to me. I come outside. We're not talking to here. I feel like they made each other in a way, you know what I'm saying? I think Nick don't talk to me. Nick did a lot for Chris for sure. Bro, I cannot be the only one who find this funny. You got Nick out here just working on dribble moves, minding his own business. And they're talking shit and on to each other. Line, you got a huge paint protector yelling Jeez. at him out and cussing at him. And, and like I said in the last video, man, Chris is the best beefing. player. That's expected. Well, you, you can probably see Chauncey's the best player in Savage Squad, but Chris, Chris is, is definitely the line. most viable player. And now they lost that. Savage Squad's going to be trash. It's only two seconds long. It's Nick apparently walking out with security. Chris said that he got a private staff member to Damn. escort him outside. You guys can say what you want oh, about so that's this. The third clip. I'll be honest. If I had beef with this Chris dude, I I'd do the same thing. I'd be doing the same thing. No shit, bro. I don't know. Uh, I wouldn't put myself in a position to uh, get beef with him, but you know what I'm saying. Comments under the post. I did find this one interesting. This person said, "You got 150 pounds on him, bro. Why are you trying to fight someone?" Hey, don't matter the size, bro. If you're talking I'm shit not to him. I'm not gonna say too much about this. Yep, I agree with Russ. Chris pulled up on him. You're going to have the argument where a lot of people say, well, heck, yeah, Nick was talking crap. It's their beef. It's their business. Uh, yeah, no shit. Why wouldn't he pull up? Why should Chris be the bigger man when Nick's talking crap to him? You can view it however you want to. Let me know in the comment section the what you think The fake Savage from Savage Squad. I don't Squad. really have a say-so in it. Do you yeah, you know what's crazy? I just found out that Nick, caught, Nick got like 100% of the revenue right off the Savage Squad merch. When it's not Nick Briz merch. It's Savage Squad okay, merch. You know okay, what I'm saying? I'll say this. I understand that Chris is extremely mad. That doesn't even do it justice. And he pulled up on him this would be one too. time. Maybe it was a coincidence. After setting paying but people to fight you with, without uh, telling you, bro? Come on. That's, that's, that's not Chris right, bro. constantly pulling up on Nick. That may be, you know, crossing the line. My biggest this man is stretching this video. I want to know how he found him. Who you think about this in the comments? Well, his channel. All right, man. That's going to be the end of the video, man. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know what you're reacting next. Subscribe if you're new. Peace.